This is a question for the Locker Gnome channel. Uh, this is about car audio. And uh, back in 2008, I had purchased uh, this receiver. And uh, the reason I got this receiver is because, as you can see here, it has USB. Um, now I'm somebody that, uh, you know, I invest money in speakers and the receiver. I don't want to be listening to MP3 or a lossy format, so I wanted the uh, uncompressed, lossless, but I don't really want to be, you know, carrying around tons of CDs. So uh, I tried using the thumbstick USB devices and uh, it just doesn't hold enough. So I then uh, went on to using something like this, which is just a uh, regular 2.5 inch SATA drive. Um, bought a little case for it, cost about five bucks. And uh, I had to do a little testing, but uh, turns out that this right here that has power and data doesn't actually have enough power or the receiver doesn't pull enough power from this cable to run this drive. So I have to use a secondary USB port that is into my car that is where the, uh, I guess the adapter socket would be for uh, power devices. And uh, the issue I'm having is that there's got to be a better way to do this. I mean, when the car's off, I have to keep unplugging both these cables and make sure it's not actually pulling this drive, uh, powering this drive. So I'm just wondering if there's any other alternative to get a hard drive to play back on this receiver without having to like use two USB ports. Uh, thanks.